How's it going, everybody? Nathaniel from RC Insight here, and today I am back with more LEGO news for you guys. We got a ton of new LEGO set images today, and so I'm going to be going through these in a bunch of different videos. And this first one here is on the new LEGO City Wildlife set images that we've got. I'm going to be breaking down the set images we have, talking about these sets a little bit, just covering all the news for you guys so you guys can kind of get the whole rundown on what has just been announced. Real quick, let me know what you guys think about these sets in the comments down below. I'm always interested to hear what you guys have to say. If you like these, if you don't, are they overpriced? They obviously are. It's Lego City. But anyway, yeah, let me know in the comments down below. Interested to see that. And with that said, let's jump right into talking about these new sets. So the first one here is uh, Lego City set 60300. Uh, and as per promo bricks, this is the Safari Quad. Uh, for some reason, promo bricks is not translating properly but uh, it's definitely more than 14 pieces. This is going to be a $10 set in Europe, so I'm assuming it's also probably gonna be 10 in the United States and probably that 14, 13, $14 range in Canada. And uh, assuming it's that price, I think this is an okay set. Uh, we've had tons of these quads before, but I really like the red and I do like this new wildlife sticker piece here, this wildlife logo for Lego's wildlife theme. Uh, in this set, uh, we get a kind of okay looking little tree build with these really nice monkey mold pieces here. Two monkeys and then also a scorpion in this set. The minifigure feels like nothing special to me. Uh, getting the drone here included is also cool. I, I like that even though it's a really simple build. I think it's a nice little addition. And uh, this set does come with that new turning action feature that was introduced in the January of this year, I believe. So uh, overall, I think uh, if this does in fact end up being, you know, $10 US, $13 in Canada, $14 in Canada, then this is definitely going to be one that I'm interested in picking up because I obviously want to dip my toes into this new wildlife theme. And I like a lot of the components here, even though we've seen, you know, ATVs like this before, the monkey molds, the little tree build, that's all pretty good here. The next set here is this 60301, which uh, I, I can't read the German here. I don't know why it's not translating, but this is going to be 157 pieces, and it's going to be $45 uh, in Europe, so 45 euros. And that makes me a little concerned in terms of where it's going to fall in price-wise in North America. I, 157 pieces. I would have to assume it's going to be at least $50 in the United States, $60 in Canada. $60 for a 157-piece set would be ridiculous. This should be no more than $25 or $30. So we'll see. That being said, this is a 4-plus set that looks surprisingly not very 4-plus to me. And honestly, like... I would buy this, and for those of you who've watched my channel for a while, you know that I really don't like 4 Plus sets, but I think this uh, this off-road vehicle here is a really nice looking build. Uh, we get a nice little boat in here as well, and then this structure in the background I think is great too. Uh, the lion mold is awesome looking, and we also have this really weird snake piece. It looks like it's a golden snake, which is uh, interesting to say the least. There's also a lion cub up there, which I think is pretty neat. So uh, all in all, I think there's a lot of really nice looking stuff in here. I love that it's these simple but uh, effective little kind of rock hill builds. Uh, you got some nice detailing with the bones, the egg back there, and you even have a little campfire with a fish back over here and another tree build. So I really like what I see in this set, but at 157 pieces and what I see at this set, this is a $25 set, not a 50, 60, please not $70 set, right? So I'm really, really concerned about how ridiculously overpriced this is going to be, but I think this set looks great. I'm really happy with how this one looks as well. And then the last one here is 60302, and this is all there is in the way of wildlife stuff as far as we're aware. There's only three sets, which again, I think is a real shame. There is so much potential for this theme. To limit it to only three sets is a little bit disappointing to me. Uh, I really wish they would have done more. Uh, but this one here, again, can't read the name, but this is the helicopter one, and it's going to be 525 pieces and 90 euros. So 90 euros, you're probably looking at least $100 in the U.S., probably $130 in Canada for a 525-piece set. And so you're just talking about stuff that is so absurdly overpriced. I remember when a 525-piece set would be $80. 
not nearly twice that. And and so, you know, the price ranges are probably going to prevent me from buying these sets. But the sets themselves, I really like. And I really like this one as well. I don't care for the helicopter that much. We've seen helicopters like this a million times before. However, uh, I do really like the color of the helicopter with this beige. I think it's really unique. And, uh, you know, quite honestly, we've seen builds like this little truck over here as well in the Arctic theme before. But again, I like the beige color. But what stands out to me here is the animal mold. I mean, this is impressive. That elephant mold is incredible awesome there's a baby elephant alligator i think you can't tell the image is a little blurry but there's something else hiding here in the corner i think there's another monkey mold uh another monkey on top of this little uh tent workstation here and i love this little build too this tent workstation build i think is fantastic that's a great little build and then also i love having brick built terrain from the tree to the kind of land and the water area for the for the animals i love brick built terrain uh, and I wish I had more of it in my city. So I love this set. I think it's great. And I want to buy it. In fact, I really want to buy all three of these wildlife sets. I think all three of them would go really well together. I think they're great sets. But the price points here, I, I know, are going to be so overpriced. Just knowing the price in Europe, like... It's just going to be so beyond expensive that I probably am only going to end up getting the one of them, which is a real shame because these are really nice sets. And I think Lego City actually hit it out of the park with these. So uh, yeah, I'm a really big fan of what we're seeing here for this wildlife wave of Lego City sets. Um, but I'm not going to be able to justify forking over the money that it's going to cost. That's my thoughts on these new LEGO City sets, guys. Like I said at the beginning, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. And uh, that will be it for this video. If you guys like this video, click the like button down below. Subscribe for more content like this. Today, there's going to be a whole lot of videos talking about all the new set images that have been released. So if any of that interests you, subscribe so you can be notified as soon as those videos come out. And stay up to date here all my thoughts on the new LEGO sets. And with all that said... Thanks so much for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next video.